Evolutionists claim the Earth and the universe are millions and billions of years old. The Bible tells us God created it all 6,000 years ago. But evolutionists cannot possibly correct. You see, if the Earth is really billions of years old, as they claim, then how do you explain the following? You see, we have found insects trapped in amber that has not decayed. The amber, supposedly millions of years old, containing these dead insects, well, the insects trapped inside, even without bacterial decay, the insect materials inside should have completely spontaneously broken down over time. As molecular bonds break down over time spontaneously, these should leave unrecognizable residues. However, Australian embers have been reported with, and I quote, beautifully preserved insects. They cannot possibly be as old as evolutionists claim. And again, they claim it's billions and billions of years old, but if that were true, how do you explain the following? Again, yeast that has been found in amber has not decayed. As a matter of fact, still living yeast cells were extracted from California amber, supposedly 45 million years old, according to evolutionists. There was a small brewery in Guerneville, California that brewed them using the yeast, a beer. It was as a sales gimmick. Yet, if they were 45 million years old, their metabolic waste should have fatally poisoned them eons ago. You see, these materials cannot possibly be as old as evolutionists claim. Even life in a suspended state of animation, such as bacteria or yeast, simply cannot be that old, because it doesn't matter how slow you have the metabolic rate slow down, something is still happening. And if these materials were 45 million years old, their own wastes would have poisoned them to death by now. They could not possibly still be alive. Therefore, you can see that this is all young, created 6,000 years ago, exactly as the Bible says.